Okay, here we go with reaction number four. In this reaction, we will react that copper two oxide with hydrochloric acid. This will create copper two chloride and water. So the first thing we're gonna do is use a dropper filled with three molar hydrochloric acid. We're gonna rinse that filter paper that contains that black precipitate. So that's just some of that copper two oxide from the previous reaction. We're gonna wash it back into the original container using hydrochloric acid. See how clean that got? Okay, before we start the rest of this reaction, I want you to make observations of these reactants. To make this task a little easier, we're going to add a magnetic stir bar. That will allow it to continuously mix as I add droppers full of hydrochloric acid. So this is the same three molar hydrochloric acid as before. And I'm just gonna continue adding droppers full of this until I can tell the reaction is complete. Well, it looks like our reaction is complete. Don't forget to make observations of these products. The last thing I wanna do is remove the stir bar. And now when I remove this magnetic stir bar, it's going to have a little bit of that copper solution on it. So I'm gonna remove it and then rinse that copper solution back into the beaker so I don't lose any of that copper product. 